What's up ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my top 5 best electric skateboards of 2016. We're going to be taking a look at everything from boosted boards to inboards to marble boards and so on and so forth. We're actually going to start the video off with Evolve skateboards. Now they have the widest range of electric skateboards that you guys will probably find on the market right now. They're all pretty expensive, however they're good for certain things. Some of these can go over grass, rocks, so on and so forth, while others are simply for cruising around on the street. Because of their wide variety, I think they should be a number of they should be on the top five in general as you can see they got different deck materials they have different deck lengths different wheels different trucks bearings so on and so forth the max loads are also somewhat different most of them actually are 100 kilograms hills as you guys can see are usually the same most of them have a lot of similarities but there's a handful of things that make some of them stand out and not the other ones as you can see street all terrain street all terrain and that's one of the biggest reasons that i thought this would be a cool place to start off since they give you a pretty nice amount of variety while all the other electric skateboards just give you that one electric skateboard you either like it or you move to another company and i don't know how i feel about that so of course number two on our list is actually a really creative idea this is known as the mellow drive and basically you can attach this to any longboard of your choice and of course all of a sudden any longboard turns into a boosted board awesome right or it turns into an electric skateboard depending on what you guys like to call it so this thing is actually made in germany it has something to do with a tesla battery that just sounds cool in itself and it has a two-year warranty as you guys can see there it is you can also get two of these and of course the coolest part about this is well it can go up to 25 miles per hour with almost no noise but it gets even better because say you run out of battery there's battery packs that can actually be removable and then you could take another battery pack out of your ba uh, out of your backpack and then place it in here so you can technically speaking have unlimited charge as long as you're consistently charging up two batteries or you have a bunch of batteries in there now it's not exactly cheap it's around a thousand five hundred to two thousand dollars which is ridiculous but considering you get a nice 10 mile range and of course you get a pretty slick remote and it's a premium product with a premium looking app i'd say the mellow board is a pretty good thing to wait for in case you have a long board and don't feel like like, I don't know, changing it because you spent so much time customizing that particular longboard or something of that sense. Number three on our list happens to be inboard. Now, this is something that has not yet been released, but the hype is absolutely ridiculous since these guys are promising so much from a 45 minute charge time to insane speeds, very good stability, lights in the front, lights in the back, wheels that are replaceable for $30 in case anything happens to them, a really, really good uh, range for the charge, and of course, a really premium looking deck. So, that is a lot of things that are promising. If you guys don't believe me go on their facebook page and just take a look at the amount of things that they are saying now this thing you can pre-order right now i actually might actually go and pre-order as you guys can see front lights and back lights how ridiculously awesome is that so this is basically if you guys are actually planning on going places with your electric uh, skateboard and you don't plan on like just buying it and then leaving it there this is probably the best one to go with right now so you do have to pre-order and you do have to wait a little bit of time but i think it is worth it but say you don't feel like waiting a single second then of course the obvious one on the list is the boosted dual now this is one of the best boosted boards and is probably the most popular in of course electric skateboards in general it's just really well designed it's as premium as it gets this is of course the name brand for electric skateboards everyone knows boosted board they have a pretty slick looking remote the charge time is great however the specifications aren't as great compared to some of the other ones that we took a look at as you guys can see this thing has an 1500 watt electric motor and of course as you guys can see we have the boot, uh, bluetooth remote control right here 60 minute fast charge which is it which is great but I hope it gets better on the next few editions has a max speed of 20 miles per hour um, its range is seven miles which is decent but we're gonna be taking a look at one last board that's even better and of course the power as I just said 1,500 watts your hill climb is really good 20% grade so you should have no trouble getting up to the toughest hills um, weight is 15 pounds this is worth a little tough that is pretty heavy and of course the deck length is 38 inches I'm um, carrying these things aren't exactly easy but I found a cool trick for carrying my electric skateboard basically what you do is you find a belt you loop it around the tire um, one of the front tires and then you just pull it <laughs> it's so simple so that's my little trick for you guys and finally we're gonna be taking a look at our number one this is the boosted board that I actually decided to go and get I should stop calling these things boosted boards but it's it's I feel like that's just one of those things that's like Purell's a brand Purell is also a thing that everyone seems to call hand sanitizer I feel like boosted boards is gonna be like that name that everyone ends up calling electric skateboards because electric skateboard just doesn't sound as cool but anyhow pro uh, props to marble for making a pretty solid board this is the one that I actually went ahead and got now the reason I got this is because it's at 10 pounds it's so light I need a board that's super light this thing can go up to 25 miles per hour and it can go 16 miles 
per charge. How insane is that? So of course, as you guys can see, they have recommendations from a lot. Besides the fact that it looks so slick, the blue, blue wheels and the black deck with the giant marble logo on top, that's absolutely awesome. As a carbon fiber composite deck, the battery is a lithium ion battery system. And of course, it has a 2000 watt brushless motor. As you guys can see, these guys just cream boosted board, cream inboard, and cream every other company out there when it comes to specifications. And of course, the only downside to these guys is that they're having some complaints when it comes to customer service, but that's not something to do with the product. That's something they can improve as they get a little bit bigger. It comes with a cool little wireless remote, and of course, it consists of an app as well. Um, the two wheel options is 76 millimeters or 100 millimeters, and it's your choice as to what color you guys want to actually get it in. So say I was to go and order this right now, the price would be at a whopping $1,399, which is, yes, more than the boosted board, and of course, more than every other board we pretty much saw, and that's without the 100 millimeter wheels. That brings it up to $1,500. But considering the fact that how good this is, I think you guys will maybe want to invest in it, depending on what you're looking for, whether you're going with a budget option. I did make a video on the cheapest electric skateboards you can go ahead and get right now, so go ahead and check out that video if you guys want as well. But these are my top five best, and I feel like these are the companies that are probably going to be ruling this whole area, industry, whatever this is going to end up being as time progresses. So thank you guys for watching. Leave a like on the video. This is going to be me logging off.